Alright, man. What gives, man? What gives here at Pick and Pull, man? This is some bull crap, man. <laughs> I'm over there checking out that uh, 63 Buick La Sabre over there, La Sabre. That just came into the yard. You know, I check, you know, often to see what's. I won't say often, every day for the most part. I mean, I don't. Even if I miss a day or two, I. I shouldn't have missed this. Uh, yeah. They didn't post this car on their website. They did not. Bastards! <laughs> they got this thing for 5123. I mean, like I said, I'd. If they did and I missed it, I'm I'm the freaking idiot. <laughs> yeah, man, 75, 1975, Pontiac Granville convertible, bro, hammy or Brom, as it's supposed to be called. I'm gonna say this probably had the 455 in it. The hood was sitting on the ground, it was all dented in. People walked over, kind of, kind of knocked it back out. Somebody made a <laughs> said, like, Ben is the only one putting parts back on cars in the yards. <laughs> I know, right? Oh man, this is what I, I should have started on this side. This looks better over here. Yeah, freaking the second convertible uh, that I've run into, big bodies, man, like in within the past few months. This was all hanging down. I stuck it back up there. Of course, the bumper's gone. Last in a row is that 09? Is that 99? I think it's 99. That's 99. Yeah, 909. That, that, it would be the different uh, stickers for... Um, it's more current stickers now. This convertible top isn't even ripped or anything. I mean, this is all faded, but... The convertible top's not... I mean, the, the fabric's not in bad shape, actually. Rear end still there. It's got the uh, sway bar. Got them dual uh, flow masters on it. So it says it came out 428. Well, they said it said five something. I don't know. I don't know, man. Yeah, I'm pissed that I didn't get to this car sooner. Not because I know I wanted the engine or anything. I've got. Wait, do I have a? Do I have a? Oh, you know what? That is. I do. I have. A, no, I don't have a 455. That's the only. The only four I, I had the 455. I had a Buick 455, and I got an Olds 455. No Pontiac. Got a couple of two or three of the uh, the 400s though. These tail lights they don't look too bad. They're getting ready to close too, man. I'm surprised they haven't hit that. Uh, oh, I probably spoke too soon. They're gonna they're gonna hit that siren on me. So this was done by the yard. Had that nice baby blue. Soft top for the convertible, the cover there for the convertible. Too bad it's not the hard, the hard uh, top thing, you know, for the convertible. Those are worth some bread. I'm really not going to get underneath it because you can see right there, she's kind of tilting. I don't want to. I don't want to get trapped underneath this thing. Rusts in there, but overall not too bad. Of course, you know the hood underneath. We got there's nothing. You know they took the engine transmission. She did have a well, being a, a broom, she had to have, had to, she had to have been. You know, fully loaded so she's got the uh, screws there let's see if I can get in there good enough the Google man she did have power power windows I'm assuming yeah or yeah, I got power windows. I think power locks too, or maybe not. There it is, Granville Brom. She does have a crack right there on the uh, on the dash. This is actually a good. Uh, I might come back for this this seat. I might. 
glass is good both sides. I think all the glass is good except for the front don't look too bad the, the grill doesn't I don't know if we're gonna be able to see that van are we I don't know Google man I gotta hurry up though. They're gonna end up. What are we reading? 67,000? Yeah. Well, that's gonna do her. We should have got here and it was in better shape, but you know, oh well, what are you gonna do? Beggars can't be choosers, so. Gotta get it the way it is. Alright, people, on to the next one.